Hi, my name is Needy Bagat, and I'm going to demonstrate the three basic skills of girls lacrosse. In girls lacrosse, there are three basic skills, cradling, catching, and throwing. Let's start with cradling. Cradling is the most important skill in girls lacrosse. If you don't cradle properly, your ball will fall out, or if you don't cradle legally, you will get called for it. First, you want to place your dominant hand a few inches below the head. Then you want to put your stick across your body, placing the other hand according to your comfort. Begin with the head in the middle of your face. Now, bring the head across your face while curling your dominant hand in towards your body. Cradling at home while you're watching TV or doing something else is a good way to practice. The next skill is catching. In order to catch a ball, your eyes need to follow the ball and you need to bend your knees. Your eyes need to follow the catch and your knees need to bend depending on where the ball is passed. Immediately after the pass, you should cradle the ball in order to secure the ball. Again, catching lacrosse ball gets easier the more you practice. Lastly, let's learn how to pass. In girls lacrosse, it's important to pass accurately. First, you want to lower your dominant hand to just above the center of the shaft. Keep your non-dominant hand close to the bottom of the shaft. Keep the head next to your ear. Flick the wrist of your top hand while pulling your bottom hand towards you. Follow through with the motion. A proper pass will see the top of the shaft move directly over the bottom of the shaft in a straight line. The three basic skills, cradling, catching, and passing, all come with a lot of practice. The more you practice these skills, the better you get. Thanks for watching.